This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. So you don't think of see analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the data they released us is false. It's made to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, the bad actors are doubling and tripling down on their criminality with AMC. AMC is not going down, in my opinion, because retail investors are selling. And I believe, and this is just my opinion, even if retail investors are selling, there are institutions that are buying up those shares because they know, they know that these AMC naked shooters are in deep trouble. And they know that it's not, it's not just retail investors they have to worry about. They are, they are big dogs that they have to worry about also because they are holding on to the real shares and those counterfeit shares that they've pushed into the market to manipulate the price. Okay? And everybody knows what they're doing. Everybody knows what they're doing. And, and, and the other thing is this, and this is just my opinion. I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell AMC. But there are some people that if it hit $250, they are going to buy more. If it hit $2, they are going to buy more. If it hit $150, they are going to buy more. <laughs> so there's, in my opinion, there's no way out for these AMC naked shorters. Okay? They're done. I believe they'll be filing bankruptcy way before AMC. Anyway, here are the AMC numbers. The alleged numbers, anyway. The volume, 16,179,807. I tell you guys every day, those numbers mean absolutely nothing because we have no idea what's going on in the dog pools. We have no idea what's going on on the other exchanges that they're using to manipulate the price of the stock. So that volume is for gazy, as far as I'm concerned. Calls in the money, 1,028 at $3, additional 12,428. They don't have to hedge. I tell you guys that every day. These guys can just create more counterfeit shares to short into the market to manipulate the price so they will never have to go into the open market and buy shares. So in my opinion, just my opinion, there will never be an AMC gamma squeeze because they don't have to they don't have to buy any shares until until they'll, until their liquidity runs out or the SEC steps in and starts enforcing the rules of the market or the judge rules that they need to shut down the trading of AMC and GME in the dog pools till we get an accurate share count. These bad actors are in deep trouble. Anyway, 67.5% of the volume was shorted shares. So that's like 11 million of the volume was shorted shares. Now, now where are they getting millions of shares to short every single day? They shorted 10, 20 times the float, yet... The SEC doesn't see anything that requires an investigation. The Department of, of Justice doesn't see anything that requires an investigation. The FBI doesn't see anything that requires an investigation. And the days to cover, 3.88. But all that is based on self-reported numbers. In my opinion, the numbers are a whole lot higher. And there won't be an easy out, in my opinion, for the bad actors naked shorting AMC. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think there will ever be a gamma squeeze as long as these bad actors can continue creating counterfeit AMC shares in order to manipulate the price? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.